It's Little Miss Bliss. The following contest is an eight-man battle royal. Making his way to the ring from Columbus, Ohio, the Raw Women's Champion, Five Alexa feet of fury. Bliss. The first woman to ever capture the SmackDown and Raw Women's Championships, Alexa Bliss, the goddess of WWE. Superstar Alundra. Battle Royal coming up next, guys. Hey. Nicole, I can realistically see any one of these six superstars walking away with a win here tonight. dominance, her unique appearance, and her unmistakable aura have all made Asuka one of the top competitors in the entire women's division. Lived up to the hype, surpassed the expectations, an undefeated run in NXT, NXT Women's Champion. A title she relinquished willingly to head to Monday Night Raw. One of the most dominant female superstars ever in WWE. It's Bailey! Ha <laughs> yeah! Hotline! Sit down, Byron, don't touch me. From San Jose, California, Bailey. Whoa, listen to this reaction for Bailey. Saxton, don't you dare start with that whack, you wave and inflatable blah, blah, blah garbage you spit out every time you see your precious Bailey. It's just an infectious feeling when Bailey comes to town, when Bailey competes, everybody's feeling hope life, except Corey. Kicker. And from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. Go ahead, Byron. Get head over heels. Tell us all why Becky Lynch is so great. Hey, listen, I remember when Becky Lynch first came to NXT, she had moved to Orlando, Florida to be a personal trainer. Never thought she'd get the opportunity to be part of this company, and now she is one of the premier superstars in our women's division. Credited with much of the women's evolution. Let me 
Amazon Beth Phoenix. Plenty of action coming up as we have six of WWE's top names ready to go here. Oh man, Michael, six man matches like this always remind me of world class back in the 1980s. One half of the Australian duo known as the Iconics. And from Sydney, Australia, Billy Kay. Beautiful and dangerous, Billy Kay. Beautiful and dangerous. Billy Kay. Billy Kay Byron wouldn't allow you to breathe the same air she does. Who said I want to hang out with her? It's not really an option, Saxton. Billy Kay exists in a whole world you know nothing about. A world of beauty, a world of danger. Yeah, how about a world of lies and deceit? Billy Kay and her best friend, Peyton Royce have taken WWE by storm. Bree mode! The following contest is a battle royale. Making his way to the ring from Scottsdale, Arizona, Bree Bella. Brie Bella, a, a champion. She's a trailblazer in the women's revolution. She's got two hit television shows. Brie Bella, a billboard example of breaking the glass ceiling and pursuing all of your dreams. Corey, you can't deny that Brie's a trailblazer in the women's revolution. And you can't deny that most of it's because there's an identical twin running by her side all the time. From Staten Island, New York, the Princess of Staten Island, Carmella. Byron, are you ready to admit the truth yet? That Carmella is the most obnoxious woman in the entire women's division? You are delusional. Mella is money. Well, it's great where you can wear blinders. Why would I want blinders on when Mella's around? So what would you know anything about how to win a title like Mella? So I see you're kissing up to Carmella as well. Why wouldn't I? I think she's an unbelievable talent. Mella is money. And from the Queen City, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Charlotte. Back at NXT, Charlotte was part of a group called the Four Horsewomen with Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Wow, has Charlotte evolved from those times? Ladies and gentlemen, you are looking at one of the reasons that the women's revolution has become the women's evolution. Charlotte has spearheaded a movement to take this women's division to a level of competition it has never seen before. It's about time I heard you pay the queen her proper respect, Saxton. The statistician for Titus Worldwide. And from Cleveland, Ohio, Dana Brooke. Oh, Tremendous athlete, great competitor. 
Dana Brooks, certainly one of the hardest workers in the women's division, always trying to learn new skills and techniques to better her game. You have any great stats on this match tonight at NXT for Dana Brooke? Yeah, 60% of the time, Dana Brooke's statistics are right every time. And what exactly are these statistics? Well, it depends on the situation, Byron. It's not like she just pulls these facts out of thin air. There's a lot of research, there's development, there's studies involved. Hopefully they come with a fact checker. Here comes the war goddess. Her entrance is just as unique as her offensive playbook. Despite the fact that the title is not on the line here tonight, I still expect to see the champ fight her fight once the bell rings. I wouldn't expect anything less, Cole. The champ I know doesn't take nights off, regardless of what's at stake. And from Seattle, Washington, Ivory. A true pioneer. Ivory, incredibly comfortable in high pressure situations, has won women's championship matches multiple times over her illustrious career. I miss when Ivory was part of Right to Censor. Of course you do. They had a good message. You know, I once spent 12 straight hours on the air with Ivory, part of a program called WrestleMania all day long. You know, to this point in his life, Byron's never spent 12 hours cumulatively with a woman. Congratulations, Cole. Here comes the Hall of Famer. And from Dallas, Texas, Jacqueline. You know, Jackie and Terry once formed a group called PMS. Pretty mean sisters. You know, Jackie and Terry once formed a group called PMS. Pretty mean sisters. Not only was she a trainer and tough enough, she actually managed Booker T. Unanimously regarded as one of the toughest treat to see Trish Stratus in action here tonight. This is going to be fun. And from Stanford, North Carolina, Lita. Just as responsible for the women's revolution as anybody. Talk about a, a woman who's made so much history here in WWE. Remember when she was the first female, along with Hall of Famer Trish Stratus, to main event Monday Night Raw? And she was such an important part of the Hardy Boys Team Extreme. And from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, Maurice. Here comes the two-time champion. Maurice had one of the longest championship reigns of all time. And now she, here she is on pay-per-view, an A-lister in her own right. Why does Maurice always feel it's necessary to inform the world that they're not allowed in her personal space? Because Maurice feels necessary to inform the entire world that they're not as good as she is. There's a humble attitude. It's the sad facts of life, Saxton. It is a very questionable attitude. There's nothing to question. By and from Richmond, Virginia, Mickey James. Oh, 
a six-time champion. Think about everything this woman has accomplished in her career, and then talk about her all-time great rivalries with three Hall of Famers, Trish Stratus, Lita, and Beth Phoenix. Well, Mickey, you've got a list of great matches a mile long, but let's talk about her six women's championships. Mickey has an opportunity tonight to make a little bit more history. Corey. What? It's glow time! I'm surprised you enjoy this this much, Saxton, seeing as how you're afraid of the dark. And from Orlando, Florida, Naomi! It glows like having a nightlight, so it's okay. Naomi is one of the most respected superstars in all of the women's division. Who once beat Naomi in a dance contest? Oh, no. Don't say it. I really did. did you pull a muscle? She's got nothing on me. One of the most athletic superstars in the history of WWE. A former pro basketball cheerleader, professional dancer. Naomi can do it all from bell to bell. And one of the most fun and exciting entrances in all of WWE. How can you not bob your head, Corey, when Naomi comes out? How can you not get lost in the moment? The following contest is a battle royale. Making his way to the ring from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Natalia. Product of the Hart Family Dungeon carrying on the legacy of the legendary Hart Family in sports entertainment. Natalia always ready to handle things inside the ring. Now the daughter of Jim the Animal Nightheart, the niece of WWE Hall of Famer, Brett the Hitman Hart. She's got the power of her father and the finesse of her uncle. Superstar in the entire women's division. The irresistible force. And from San Diego, California, Maya Jax. Hey, whenever Nia Jax enters an arena, whenever Nia Jax enters a match, everyone takes notice of the dominance that this woman is capable of. She's beautiful, she's powerful, she's dangerous. It's like a million dollar smile on a wrecking ball. Nia Jax is the irresistible force to be reckoned with. Caster Sexton. Or oh, just a grump. Fearless! Indeed she and is! From Scottsdale, Arizona, Nikki Bella! Go ahead, Byron. Tell us about how inspired you are. Not just me, Corey, but the entire WWE Universe. Nikki Bella, she is fearless. She is driven. Great role model as well. You should strive to be more like Nikki Bella. Got two television shows. Former champion. The world wouldn't know what to do with two of me. Oh, gosh. Don't even let us think about it. Shut up, Byron. Look who's in her house. And... From Norwich, England, Paige. Let's go. 
from the start. Paige dared to be different. Paige dared to stand out, and she has benefited yeah! from that mindset. Guys, remember on Raw a few years ago when Paige made her WWE debut and won the Women's Championship? A truly unforgettable night, not only for Paige, but the entire WWE Universe. Paige has revolutionized the game since that very night. And it was that night where we began the transformation. And their opponent. On the rise. From Sydney, Australia. And what would be a tremendous Peyton career. Royce. Here comes Peyton Royce. Byron, I was back in the locker room area earlier today, and I heard Peyton Royce imitating you. Imitating me? It was an unbelievable impersonation. She does great impressions. Spot on, Byron Saxton. Oh, and by the way, she also handles her business inside the ring. A student of Lance Storm, Peyton Royce is absolutely incredible. Look at her, Byron. Yeah, I can see her. Beautiful and deadly. A true Venus flytrap. And from Lafayette, Indiana, Ruby Ryan. Ruby Ryan has said all along, if I would was in the business of pleasing people, I wouldn't be here. I'll do things the way that I want to do them. Ruby Ryder doesn't care about anybody but herself. That's the way she likes it. It's boss time! And here comes Sasha! And from Boston, Massachusetts, Sasha Banks! Sasha Banks has made a great deal of history here in WWE. Competed in the first ever Women's Hell in a Cell match, multiple time Raw Women's Champion. Corey, I don't understand what your issues are with Sasha Banks. She's one of the all time greats. You ever talk to her? She's in time. There's no questioning what Stephanie McMahon has done for our industry, but uh, well, some would say her personality can be abrasive at times. You tell her that, Byron. Go tell Stephanie that she's abrasive. Uh, she seems busy right now. Some would say that perhaps her attitude leaves a little bit to be desired. Well, she's she's the some, boss. some better find their way to the unemployment line. Well, I'm not me, I'm just saying.
And guys, the title may not be on the line here tonight, but the stakes are still incredibly high. That's right. Could you imagine if she lost this match? Sure, she'd still be the champ, but you can bet that doubt will have begun creeping into her mind. And once that happens, you can kiss that title goodbye. This is awesome. And from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Trish Stratus. Trish Stratus, the first woman to main event a Monday Night Raw. Trish has a resume a mile long, but plain and simple, she may be the single greatest female superstar to ever step foot in a WWE ring. Yeah, a true trailblazer. Thanks for checking out our Dolly Dolly 2K19 women's roster pre-release footage. Stay tuned to the revolution for more upcoming pre-release footage and don't forget to check out our official website www.therevolution.co.uk